Catfish is a new hit reality-based documentary series. It's about revealing the truth and lies of online dating. A catfish is an individual who creates a fake profile on social media, pretending to be something different than they truly are. Hey Eve, what's up? Come check this out. I got a girl who's contacted us, who's uh, been talking to somebody um, for a few months now, and she's interested in meeting them. Um, she said her dad's really against the online dating and everything, and interesting. And uh, he's a widower, you know. She's been trying to get him back into the dating site, you know, himself, but uh, he's just not having that. Yeah, let's let's get in touch with her and get some information. Okay. Put your straw back in, honey. Hello. Hey, Auntie Peter. This is Eve and Maxine. How are you? Good. How about you? Oh, yeah, we're doing good. We just been calling to tell you that um, we decided we're willing to come out and help you and, and get this on the road. And, you know, um, we really want to make sure you're safe and, and make sure that... Uh, Don't feel safe and equal by yourself. No way. Thank you so much. I am so excited. Thank you. Thank you. I'll see you later, okay? Thank you. Bye. So why do you need our help again? Well, I've been talking to this guy online. And we can't really, you know, talk like, on the phone or Skype. Um, because I'm really... Well, Restricted through what I can do because my dad, he's very strict. Um, I just really want to meet him and we all know how today's world is, so it's really dangerous too. I just don't want to be alone. Well, how long have you guys been talking? We've been talking for about six months now. Like, we text almost every day. Uh, and then as soon as I get home from school, like, we'll get online and talk through um, the website we're using. So you guys only text and message? You guys don't talk on the phone? No, because, yeah, I have to be able to delete everything, and when I'm home, my dad's home, and he'll get really mad, like, I can't. No Skype, nothing. You guys have never seen I'm not seen allowed him. to have Skype. You, have you seen a picture of him? No. Wow, how do you guys meet? Just online? Yeah, there's this, um, there's this website, like, it's like this, I don't even know the name right now, but I'll show you once I, once we get home. Um, and I had, you make, like, your profile, kind of like every dating site. And he was the first one to message me, and ever since then, like, um, we've been talking every day. He was out every day. It just sounds so fishy. I mean, no picture, dating website, talking for six months. I mean, I, I, I don't know what to say. I mean, <laughs> what does your mom think about all this? Uh, my mom, I never really met my mom. She died in a car accident, really, like, when I was really young. So, that's all I really want. Sure, if you're serious about this, uh, but I just think that we should get feedback from your dad. I mean, I mean, your mom's well, not here. We need it. We need to make he sure. can't know about about me being on an online dating site and meeting someone. He will kill me. Like he cannot know. All right. Well, thanks for the information. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and talk to um, Maxine about all this that we got and see if we can help you. Because you sound you sound like we need to help you. I do. We need you need this. So. Thank you we'll get so back much. to you about it. All right. Thank you.
We are coming right back to this episode of Catfish right after these commercials, but please stay tuned for interesting stuff. Hey y'all, who likes to go catfish? I sure do, so this is how you gotta do it. And then you get your bait, and you hook it on there. And that was Fishing with Vicky. Come back next time when we're catching bass. Too tired of fishing dinner after a long day's work? And shove it in the oven. Catfish Grill coming to a place near you. Welcome to Fishing for Singles. But here, you can find anyone you want. Signing up is easy as one, two, three. Take a look at the testimonials we have from our other users. Happy as can be. Over here, you can find just about anyone you're looking for. And go ahead and start something up with them. So whether your father slept with his mother and had you and you can't marry anyone because he doomed you. Whether you're sad and lonely. Whether you just want to meet new people. Come to Fishing for Singles. We believe that anyone can find what they are looking for. And we believe in long-lasting relationships. Over 20,000 people, maybe in your area, use this website. So come on. Fishing for Singles where you can always find a great catch. Unless you're sad and lonely and live in your mother's basement because I doubt that's ever going to happen. Welcome back to Catfish, the Edipina story. Right now, we're coming back and we're going to talk to the father about how he feels about online dating. Hi, Hi. John Costas? Yeah, that's, that's me. Hi, it's even Maxine here from Catfish. Is that the restaurant? No, we're just a part of a TV show. Uh, your daughter contacted us and she wanted uh, our help and we just came by to see if you could help us with some things. Um, we I just have a few you, questions for oh, you. you. guys want to come inside? Sure. sure. John? John, it's John Costa. Sorry about that. That's John right. Costa. It's all right. Uh, your daughter contacted us because she has a situation that we can mm -hmm. help her with. and um. Uh, situation like. Can you just tell us a little bit about her? Oh well, Edipina. Um, it's just been me and her ever since her mother died. Her mother died. Yeah. Um, she died during childbirth, but, but she doesn't know that. During what? Yeah, childbirth. That's why she's my only child. What? She told us that uh, her mom died in a car accident. No, she she died giving birth to her, and we didn't want to tell her because we didn't want to feel responsible for what happened to her mom. I mean. <sighs> That's another. It's, just, it's it's already it's already hard for her now not having one, but to know that indirectly she was a cause of her mother's death, we just we didn't want to tell her. So I understand you've been single for quite some time now. Well, yeah. Um, recently, she tried to introduce me to a dating website, but I found out she was using it too, and I didn't think that was right for her age. But I I did end up looking into it and using it, um, and I did actually start talking to somebody on there. Wow. But, okay, because. She says how against it you are for her. She doesn't know I'm using it. Okay. And I, I try to like, you know, when she leaves out with her friends or whatever, I, I, I'll get on there and everything. But, I mean, ever since I saw her using that one time, I haven't allowed her to get back on there. I, I mean, what, what do you have against it? I mean, she's for just, her. She's young. I don't want somebody to, something to happen to her. So, I mean, how long have you been talking to this woman on your dating website? Well, it's, it's been about half a year now, and um, actually just today, she we were talking about, like, meeting up finally. Maybe I can introduce her to uh, my daughter, you know, or maybe they might get along. Okay, well, I mean, we just wanted to get some information so mm -hmm. that we can uh, help her out, because we're trying to do this. We want to make sure that um, your interest and our interest is for her safety. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, we'll, we'll go meet back up with her and we'll get back to you. Well, thank you for letting All us right. know your information about Thank you, her. and, and I'm, I'm glad you're concerned about her. You know, that's, that's very important. It's really important. Oh, I, I think I 
think that's her coming now. I think that is her. Hey, Edipina. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. I'm so nervous. Hey, no, don't. Oh my gosh. You do this all the time. Thank you so much. So, how's it for day then? <sighs> it's been good. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? I am. I'm so nervous. So. Mm. Don't be oh. nervous. I mean, we're here. We this all has led up to this one moment. Are you ready for this? I don't know. Like I was getting ready and I wasn't even sure. I was so nervous. I couldn't even do my makeup right. But you know, I know this is the right thing to do. We've been talking for so long and like I do love him and I really want to get to know him. It's time. I mean, what is your plan after this? I mean, you know, me me and uh, Maxine's not going to be here for a long time. So, I mean, we're going to be out of the picture. I mean, are you guys going to continue talking? You want to build a relationship on this? What do you want to do? I really do. And I really just, you know, want to see where it goes, where we actually, you know, knowing each other and meeting up and doing stuff. Um, where I know my dad's not going to be happy, but, you know, I love him. All right. Well, we'll see where this goes. Oh, my gosh. There's the blue car. Oh, my gosh. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Oh my god. Oh my god, he's here. No way. He's here. No way. What? Oh the my hell? god. Holy <gasps> god. Oh my god. Oh my god, hold on, hold on. What? Oh my god. Um, oh I don't know what to do. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to say. Oh my god. Turn around, turn around. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Dad? John, wait, John, don't leap. Get her, don't let her leap. Hold on, don't leave, don't leave. Wait, wait, wait. We gotta get we gotta get information. Hold on. Don't leave. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't leave. Don't leave. We can't go. We can't go. Stop the car. Stop no, the car. I don't want to talk to anyone right now. He's a freaking psycho. Oh my god, oh my god, stop. Him. Hold on, we need How to get that scene. Hold on. Me? I understand, I understand. How can you do this to me? I understand, but we need to get information from him. You need to know why this happened and what is going on. No, how we can need he information. do this? I don't care. I never want to talk to him again. But you don't know. He didn't even know either. He didn't know. Pull over, pull over. No. Just I pull want over. I'm going home. I'm going home. Damn it. We need to turn around. We need to go no, get Maxine. No, I'm not. Just turn around. We need to go get her. Fine. I can't believe him. Like, how can he do this? I know, but we need to get Maxina. I can't believe that. There she is. Pick her up and we'll go figure this out. We'll go talk about it and see what we need to do. What the hell? Where did John go? What happened? Oh my gosh. What? what? How can he do this to me? He's always like, no, yeah. I'm like dating. No, you can't do that. It's so bad. When he is the one being on there talking to people he's never even freaking seen before never seen never skype with like are when you we, serious when we came here when we, we came here to no help you idea. yeah we decided that we were going to do this the right oh way you can't God. just drive off like that and he now we need knows. to go find your dad no he is not my dad that is disgusting i don't ever want to talk to him anymore like he's such a liar liar and a freaking hypocrite i never ever want to see him again this is sick it's disgusting we need to talk to him and we need to figure out what happened oh my god oh my god here. he's here i never want to speak to him again no we need to go in there and we need to talk about this no, we need to get this we need to get the same care i'm sure yes. he was just as surprised as you know Hold on, hold on, hold on. Calm her down. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna do this right, we're gonna do this right. 